peace be with you. Were you born a Muslim or did you convert? This is a question I hear often, and it, to me, it shows a certain level of ignorance in regard to what faith actually is, what Islam is, and what God wants from us. Look, you can be born into a tribe. You can be born into a family. You can be born into an organization. But you don't, you're not born in submission to God, which is what the word Islam means. You have to choose that. Technically, we are all born Muslims because when we are born, when we are young, we don't have the capacity to choose. We don't have the capacity to choose good or evil. So at that point in our life, we are in submission to God because we don't have the capacity to disobey. But as soon as we have the capacity to distinguish, uh, to distinguish right from wrong, and if we choose wrong as a pattern of our, of our life, if we choose disobedience to God as a pattern of our life, then God's word for us is fasik. Fasikun, and we are not Muslims. As soon as you as a person get to choose your actions, that is when you get to decide if you are going to be a Muslim, a person in submission to God, or if you are going to be defiantly disobedient to God. So asking somebody, did you become a Muslim or did you convert, is just simply asking them about an organization. And Islam is not an organization. It's a way of life. I think it can be misleading for people to think that they somehow have an advantage because they were born into a society where they were told that they are Muslims. And the only advantage you really have is that you have a society where it's more difficult to disobey Allah, where it's more dis difficult to disobey a God. But if you choose to disobey God anyways, then you're not really choosing to be a Muslim, are you? Everybody has to make a choice. Everybody's a convert. Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, was a convert. All the Sahabas were converts. And every single one of us gets to make that choice. All of us are converts. Peace be with you.